What's up guys, in this video I'm going to be doing a review on the Zugu binder pad case for the iPad 2. This turns any three ring binder into a binder pad. So I figured I'd do a review on this because I haven't seen another case like this. Uh, basically what it does is you take your iPad and you put it in the case or pouches as referred to and it loops on your three ring binder. So this is going to be really good for students and teachers to maybe save some space in their binder uh, rather than taking notes on paper you could take it on your iPad. As well as all your assignments, schedules and you can even possibly do research on it. And if you're like me you could sneak in a game of words with friends here or there. I mean you are spelling right so I mean it kind of relates to school. So this case is only a half inch thick with the iPad inside of it and it weighs only 3.5 ounces so it's really light, really thin, it's not going to take up too much space in your binder. I would suggest though that you have at least a one inch binder. I tried it on a half inch binder and it didn't fit very well uh, but on the one and a half inch binder I used it worked perfectly and fit perfectly. It didn't take up too much space. And they have two colors. It comes in gray or black. It's made out of polyester and I think it's the same material as they make the really nice binders out of. I think I had like one of those while I was in school. I always got the cheap binders. But it's made out of a nice material and it should keep your iPad pretty safe and secure uh, while it's in your binder on the loops. It's got padding on the back of it so that should keep the back of your iPad safe. The only issue I have with it is possibly scratching. Depending on what you have in your binder, your screen could be scratched but as long as you have papers or folders or anything like that, I think you should be fine. Uh, it does have a little rim around the screen uh, to keep it safe and keep everything off of it so you should be fine there. So I figured I'd do this video because I know a lot of you guys are going to school and trust me I know it sucks. So maybe this case could, I don't know, distract you from your schoolwork or, uh, or you could actually use it for your schoolwork. iPads are being used more and more in schools uh, by teachers, students, and now you can even actually get a lot of your textbooks uh, on the iPad so maybe it'll even save you from having to carry around a bunch of textbooks or at least cut down on some of them. And if your school has Wi-Fi this would be good to browse the web or do research on anything uh, if you're doing projects or anything like that or maybe even cheat on your test. Now I'm just kidding, don't use this case for bad intentions uh, but I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have got some ideas and probably want this case now. So I thought this is a unique idea for a case. I really like it. I'm not going to use it, obviously, because I'm not going to school. Uh, but I know if I was in school, I'd definitely want my iPad in this case uh, in my binder. So if you'd like to pick this case up, I'll give you guys a link in the description below. Or you can just go to Zugu.com. The case is 30 bucks, And if you actually use the code TIEFREE, you'll get free shipping on your order. So that's pretty cool. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this review. If you have any more suggestions uh, as to back to school related tech products, maybe some apps or cases uh, or anything else you think I should do a video on, let me know in the comments below. I'm interested to hear your feedback as well as what you think about this case. Will you be picking it up? Do you like it? Uh, what, what's your thoughts on it? If you haven't already, go ahead and hit the subscribe button up there above my videos. It'll let you know on your YouTube homepage when I post a new video. So that's good and it's free. And if you'd like to, you can follow me on Twitter, Facebook, or Google+. West Side. I went, like, I, went, West Side. No, I went like this. <laughs> so that's it. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. And I apologize for my last video. A lot of you guys didn't get that that was a joke. If you had watched it at the end, I had a little dance scene, which I'm going to go ahead and apologize for now. It's kind of weird. I'm, I know.